My name's Melanie Shannon and I'm a grazier um, at our property Wirra. Wirra is a beef cattle enterprise and we have Brahmin cross cattle so we background them for feedlot entry. Our property is 730 hectares and it's predominantly open downs but we do have some scrub and brigalow as well. So we started the Barfield Road Producer Group or the BRPG in uh, 2019. Pretty much since 2021, I have been running the group. So I've just been really passionate about um, bringing people together for social events, for talking about what we're doing on our properties, um, sharing ideas and knowledge, and just really involving people to have a focus on, on really good land management. What we found before the, we, we formed the group was that people weren't as open or as, as willing to share things as much, but as soon as we sort of put that little bit of an informal structure in place, we found that people were really quite engaged and open about some areas of their business. And especially when it came to sharing ideas or sharing some information that they might have received from a field day or a workshop, we found that um, people were sharing a lot more and openly as well with our, with our group. Another great outcome for our group has been working with technology a lot more. So we're sort of sharing more ideas and um, information when it comes to information technology, because that is an area that um, as producers, we're not really working with on a day-to-day -day basis. So when somebody can actually show us what's involved with that, we find that um, there's a lot more uptake because we're finding that producers work or learn really well when they're shown it out in the paddock and they're actually seeing what is involved with it, such as data that's associated with weigh, weighing cattle and things like that. So we, we really appreciate somebody coming out and showing us. One of the great successes of our group is that we have organisations approaching us because they know that we're a, a willing group of producers that are, that are ready and that are engaged. We're really looking to be improving our, our land management, so a lot of groups and organisations are really keen to partner with us and to work with us because we just have that real strength in numbers. In 2017, the red meat industry had made a commitment to achieve carbon neutrality by 2030. So there was a lot of talk at the time in terms of how we were going to do that. And we found that by forming a producer group, we could really have that as a focus for our individual businesses and, and ways that we could look to achieve that carbon neutrality. We were faced with this challenge. We were to become carbon neutral by 2030. We were unprepared as an industry. Um, there was a lack of extension and training opportunities for us to be able to do that. We knew as a group that we could attract a lot of interest from external parties. So R&D organisations, NRM groups, DAF, all of a sudden become very interested because it was a group environment. So we had scale of numbers of cattle, scale of hectares of property. You know, that made it more enticing for people to want to collaborate with us and go into partnership to, um, to, to deliver training opportunities, to trial new technology. We're not isolated out here, but we, we do, do live regionally. So we, we don't tend to see a lot of people. And by coming together as a group, we find that we're supporting each other and we're really helping with just giving each other some support and just some encouragement, even if, if that's what it might be. But 
it's it's just really special to to help people that are aren't going so well. I came into the Barfield Producers Group from being in the area and knowing some of the people in it and being encouraged to join because we were on a property in the area. So I joined up with my husband and we came to learn more than anything but then ended up being part of the community and that's been a massive help on our business, our mental health and our family and in just in being in part of that encouraging environment and that support of everyone. Before we joined the group, we'd often see each other at schools or in at the pub, but now we're really getting the sense that we're, we're just coming together a lot more and we've got a lot more common, common ground or a lot more interests. So um, we're finding that we're just really connecting a lot more and we're feeling like it's, it's much more of a sense of community.